Hey party people, welcome back. This is gonna be a fun one because today we are opening a super box of Topps 2024 Series 2. We've got 10 retail packs. We've got a jumbo card. Fingers crossed it's a nice rookie. We've got a silver pack, which again, really hoping for some good rookies. And we have a metallic pin. What could we get in here? Well, we could get numbered cards. We could get autos. Wouldn't something like that, a patch auto card, that would be really sweet. Heavy Lumber is a short print I haven't been able to pull yet. Would love to try and pull something like that. Or maybe a Yoshinobu Yamamoto rookie. I'm, I tell you, some of these boxes, you look on YouTube at some other videos. Obviously, keep looking at mine. But look at some of the other ones. Some of the pulls out of this product. Holy cow. We are testing our luck today. This is going to be fun. Before we do that, though, why don't you go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It would really help out the channel, boost my ego, and make me feel good about myself. But we are less. We are in the single digits away from 750 subscribers, which means we are single digit subscribers away from our next giveaway. All right, let me know down in the comments what you want to see in the giveaways. I've heard people want to see slabs given away, hanger boxes. Let me know down in the comments. And, of course, stick around because when we come back, we're going to rip this open. It's going to be fun. All right, party people, let's go right into this. Look at that, I didn't even, I didn't want to scratch the card, but all I had to do was poke a hole, nice and easy. That's one layer gone. Can we open the top and it just slide out? Hopefully, I think that's what happened the last time I opened a box like this. There it is. Here's our silver pack. We're going to put that right there. There's our pin, which we'll probably open first. And now the cards can breathe. Here's our first five. It's got that annoying glue still. Hopefully it's not as... Uh, it is. It's still the same amount of crappy glue. So we're not going to tear those apart just yet. We'll do that when we open it. Let's not reveal the big card yet. Let's open the pin first. Let's get the pin out of the way before we do the big guy. So we can get guys like Jordan Lawler, Jose Altuve. Uh, I think you can get Corbin Carroll out of this. How do we, can we just open the top here? Or am I gonna have to use the knife? There we go. Certainly don't make it easy. But I do like the addition of little things like pins, so. Let's re be ready for the reveal. It is, we got Fernando Tatis in that uniform that I think is oh so nice. Not bad, not bad, I like that pin. We're gonna throw that pin right up there. Not bad, not a rookie, but Fernando Tatis in that cool Padres uniform, that multicolor one. I. <laughs> I'm sure some people hate it, but I really like it. All right, jumbo card, what do you have in store for us? Do we have a rookie? We have a player from the Astros, Evan Carter. Evan Carter, please. Kyle Tucker. We have Kyle Tucker. I guess that's not terrible. And we actually had a companion card fall out of it. It is Carlos Correa for the Twins. I think these are, yeah, they're team cards, I think. Or they're, they're they're nothing really. So let us put these aside. Let's put you down there. Put that over there. And until we have something better. Actually, we'll just stick it right behind Ellie Dale Cruz. There we go. We'll leave that there. Now we'll jump into our first set of packs. So like I said, there are 10 retail packs in here. We're going to rip all of them hopefully some good rookies 
Wolvi Marte right there for the first one. Mm, yeah, everything else is the other way. So here we go. Irving Lopez, Rokio. Come on. Put, we'll put all the rookies in one pile. Uh, Jacob Young. Did I miss a rookie already? I think I did. Yep. Irving Lopez. go a bunch of rookies in this one already Parker Meadows not the rookies we're looking for yet and there's Craig Biggio and Noel Marte. that is a rookie insert all right so actually a bunch of rookies in that pack oh speaking of packs I still haven't learned my lesson open everything on camera let me go get what the heck I pulled uh, just the other day hold on Two hours later. Right. See this? I can't believe this. I cannot believe this. This was uh, $6.99. It was a $7 pack. I'm like, oh man, I just want to rip something. I felt this one call to me. I literally did. I don't, you know, I wouldn't say that and then it'd be wrong. Uh, just started looking through these. Oh yeah, got this, got that. Nothing special, nothing special. Not getting anything. And then something stood out. Something stood out. Have we seen anything that could stand out yet? Anything at all? Look at the tops. I saw that and I went, no way. Like it's 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 one of those team type cards. There couldn't be anything special out of this. And I was wrong. Look at that. It is a gold mirror parallel. Talk about hard cards to hit. These are not easy hits. And I got it in a $7 pack. So for $40 and all these retail packs, we're really hoping to get something. But this is why I keep telling myself film every dang pack opening this was in my car who cares I really need to film it because you get some crazy crazy stuff and I couldn't believe I pulled that so that <laughs> again I'll learn eventually eventually open every pack on camera if it's nothing I can always delete it but if not, it becomes a really special one like that. So hopefully I'll learn my lesson eventually. Here's pack number two. Oh, Gunnar Henderson. Very cool. Every, one, every pack's going to have... Oh, look at that. That's just a regular tops. That's not a gold mirror. Connor Phillips. Joe Boyle. Brendan Doyle, Mark Hanna, Jordan Walker, Hendricks, Florian Lestival. We got, ooh, we get a numbered card in our second pack. Let's go for a numbered rookie. Let's get, that looks like a gold card from here. Stick that there. It is a gold card. It is Graham Ashcroft. That 420. <laughs> 2024 so there's our first number uh, numbered card and we got a home run challenge of Fernando Tatis that's pretty sweet pack number two was not a bad pack I'm gonna go ahead and sleep this up already actually got yeah I've got some of these let's do that too so pack two doesn't disappoint we have our first numbered card and we'll put that that's a good insert right there that's probably you know two dollars three dollars who knows 
A lot of people like Fernando Tatis. I actually really like Fernando Tatis. I, maybe I'll enter that on my own. Anyway, uh, let's rip open a third pack. Here's pack three of ten. We already have one numbered card. Can we get another? Pirates. Ozuna. Zeke Duran. Nick Madrigal. DJ. There's Jonathan Ornelas. Jake McCarthy. Come on, big rookie. Jonathan Bolin. Yoshinobu. Oh, we got a hey, we got a retail blue though. Look at that. Carlos Estevez would, would have hoped for a rookie there. And what do we got? Is this another city to city? Let's look at the Matt Olson real quick. And we'll flip. No way! No way! We got a home field advantage. And it's a rookie one of Marco Luciano. See, I, to I told you guys, I said some of these hits out of this have been freaking amazing. You know, these are not easy cards to hit either. Holy crap. Real happy with this one. There you go. My son has actually hit home field advantage cards. He hit a home field advantage Ronald Acuna uh, in 2023. And now I finally can join him. The only home field advantage I had before this one, I bought. Man, I, th <laughs> I think we've already broken even with this box. A rookie home field advantage? Don't forget this retail blue. That's a nice little hit right there. We'll stick those over there. But good lord. I think, I think everything else is just going to be easy street. <laughs> okay. That one's already open. Tops, do something about this glue. It doesn't need to have so much. This one, see, it's already open. So here we go. What's this, pack number three? Christian Yelich. And Junior Caminero, I think this is going to be a Chrome one. And it is. It's a Tops Chrome rookie. So there we go. Look, just getting hit after hit. That's really nice. Orion Kirkering. I think Junior Caminero is now like, what, number two rookie in this set? Number three? Keeps rising. This is Mason Miller. Tried to get one of his autograph cards not too long ago. People paying crazy amounts for him. I mean, the guy just keeps throwing 100 miles an hour. Speaking of guys throwing just 100 miles an hour, Paul Skeens, I'm pretty sure, is going to have a rookie card in Topps Update, and everyone's going to want to get one of those, myself included. Look at this, Topps. You don't need as much glue as this. We'll just open this one then. There we go. Evan Carter, rookie right off the bat. His uh, teammate, Wyatt Langford, uh, I believe he's in the running for AL Rookie of the Year. Uh, anyway, here is pack number five. Always got to look for the Kevin Hart on the Phillies cards. You never know. Weston Wilson. J.D. Martinez. Really? On the Dodgers? I, To be honest, I didn't even think he was still playing. Just got a lot of former Red Sox going out to California. Marcus Simeon, Jordan Adams, Dylan Moore, Hunter Goodman, and we got covering the field Christian Yelich. I don't think I've pulled this insert before. That's a pretty cool looking one. And of course, the Evan Carter. Huh. Not too shabby there. All right, pack number six. Let's see it. Almost dropped it. Almost dropped it. Didn't drop it. Almost. Let's 
Ramon Marquez. You Darvish. Garrett Stubbs. Sean James McCann. Pablo Lopez and Jay German. No rookie. Oh, there we go. There's a rookie. It's about to say no rookies yet. There's Drew Smiley. Carlos Carrasco. Lawrence Butler. We've got Stuart Fairchild and Sal Perez. Look like he's having a good time there. And Garrett Cole for the stars of MLB. Not too many rookies in that one. There we go. That one was an easy one. That's how it should be the whole time. This is what, pack number seven? Yep, pack seven. Pack seven, we got Bo Bichette on the back. Marcus Stroman. Edmundo Sosa. Josh Hader. Andre Lipschitz. Joe Kelly, Nicky Lopez. Oh, when? Not a lot of rookies. Andrew Sal Frank, Ian Happ. That's it. Just a regular pack. I will, of course, double check the backs in case I miss the Golden Tops or. Jesus. Or there's some other short print didn't notice. But so far, is that another chrome? There's not another chrome. It is a Jose Altuve. And there's a Manny Machado. Indoor. Carson Spears, there we go. Starting to get some rookies again. Anthony Veneziano. Vargas, Garrett Whitlock. It'd be sweet if we got an auto out of this. We got a City to City Junior Caminero. I actually really like these City to City cards. Look how pretty that is. That's really cool. I really like the City to City cards. And we got an Around the Horn Jeff Bagwell. We have pulled a couple of cards like this. I don't really like them. I don't care too much for the colors and, you know, don't mind the older players. Like, the last around the horn I remember pulling was a Don Mattingly. Um, I just don't think they look great. I think the, uh, that Kristen Yelich one we pulled, which one's that one? Across the field or something. I can't remember the name of it, but I think that one looks a lot better. What looks even better than that would be another numbered card or an auto. I think you can get autos in the silver packs too. So it's not the end of the world if we don't get an auto in these. Because we can get an auto in the silver pack. There we go. Mason Wynn, not a terrible rookie. No way. There's no, there's no way. I, I don't know if you saw that. But I saw that in, there's no way. Is there? Could we be that freaking lucky? Jordan Lawler. The Bogarts. There's a Manny Machado. So we did, okay, so it's just a rainbow then. Holy cow, I thought we had pulled another home field advantage card. You're teasing me. Yeah. Well, here we are at pack number 10, the last of the retail packs, and look what this glue has done. This one's practically opened already. Tops, I know you want it to look good, and I know you want it to be secure, but lay off some of that glue. Ooh, it's way more than needed. Best of the best. Devers and Betts. Francisco Alvarez. Brandon Williamson. Kinstry. Where are you rookies? Cody Funderburk. Well, no Japanese rookies today for us, apparently. Unless they're in that silver pack. 
Logan Porter, Matt Vreeling. Woo! Von Ryan Express. Very cool. Probably not worth anything, but still very cool. There's Junior Caminero. That's one thing I just don't get. You're probably wearing $50,000 worth of jewelry around your neck. You can't take it off for a baseball game. Look at that. Thing's gonna give him a black eye. So, for the regular packs, we got a nice stack of rookies. We got a whole bunch of other stuff. But now is time. Last pack, a silver pack. Hopefully we got some good rookies in here. I think, can you get numbered cards in this? I don't know, but I think you can actually get autographs in this. So, let's try our luck. Our first one is a rookie, Carson Spears. Very cool. Second one, these aren't all rookies, are they? I'll take all rookies, though. There's Wade Meckler. Next up, Pablo Reyes. All right, these cards, look at the, look at it. They are very pretty. They catch the light very well. Next up, Jonathan Ornelas. So three out of four rookies, and our last one is gonna be a Blue Jays player, and it's gonna be Chris Bassett. So we got three out of the five as rookie cards. Not too shabby. I don't think we got any big rookies though, which kinda stinks. But to be honest, it really doesn't matter. Look at that. Home field advantage, Marco Luciano. That's probably like a $30 or $40 card. We got, we got our money back from the box just in that. But we also pulled a gold card. I mean, I guess that's better than an autograph because how many, how many players are gonna have autos worth more than, more than that card? But Graham Ashcraft, 420 out of 2024. Cool gold card. Not a rookie, though. We did get a ton of rookies. Look at this stack of rookies. This is from retail. We got these uh, silver packs, which are awesome. We got several Junior Camineros. Let's put that on top. Got a Mason Wynn. I think that's a pretty good one. That's a really cool Junior Caminero. We'll put that on top too. And I think we got one more Junior Caminero that was pretty nice. There's Evan Carter. Yeah, here it is, the Topps Chrome one. Very cool on that one. Yeah, a lot, lot of rookies. We didn't really hit the big ones that we want to, but we did hit, look how many rookies. This Hall stack, all rookies. Pulled a ton of regular players and all-stars. Again, this is what you're going to expect out of most of these, I'm sure. These are retail packs, after all, not, not hobby. Every single pack had a stars of MLB. And if you're lucky, another insert. That was that stack. And we did get some nice little extras. First off, this Carlos Correa came with the big card right there, Kyle Tucker. They're a limited set, too. We got this uh, Royal Blue, Carlos Estevez. A lot of people actually collect these, and it is pretty. It is a nice-looking card. And then this really cool Home Run Challenge card. I might actually enter this one instead of trying to sell it, but it does go... It pairs really well with the pin. Maybe I'll sell them both together. Maybe that'll be nice, because I don't need the pin. And Lord knows I'm not going to win the home run challenge. If you guys have ever won one of those, if you guys have ever entered and won one of those home run challenges, uh, let me know down in the comments, because I've seen a couple of the cards, and they do look pretty crazy. But, I mean, some of them are just limited to, like, depending on the player and the day. You know, they do it for, like, the whole season, I think. Uh, and however many people entered and get it right, then they print it out at the end. There are cards that were as low as like 30. You know, because only 30 people had guessed the right day for a home run, I guess. 
um, so they wait to print them out. That's really cool though. Let me know if you've ever entered and won. Uh, but this was a ton of fun opening with you guys. My first on-camera home field advantage. We did, I did get to show you this gold mirror variation. Again, I really just need to open everything on camera. I, I'll learn eventually. But this was a ton of fun. I hope you guys had fun watching because I know I had fun showing you. And if you did, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It would really help out the channel, boost my ego, make me feel good about myself. And, but it'll also help us get over that 750 subscriber hump and uh, put us in for our next giveaway. So go ahead, hit subscribe. Um, let me know down in the comments what you want to see on the giveaways. If you've ever entered the home run challenge and won, let me know. All right. And uh, whether you subscribe or not, whether you comment or not, you did watch the video up to this point. So I want to say thank you for watching and I will catch all of you on the next video. See ya.